triple top knot. So I have it in my hair right now. I think I wore something similar to this to my sophomore homecoming. I can't remember exactly, but I feel like it was something to this vibe. And I just love this hairstyle, so I'm excited to show you guys how to do it. So let's get on to the video. Okay, so I have parted my hair. I kind of wanted it half up and half down, so I parted it right here from kind of like the corner of my eyebrow, just a line drawn back all the way back to like the crown of my head and then same on the other side as well. So I have a nice good section pulled up right here that I'm gonna be using for the triple knots on the top and then the rest I pulled back because that's just gonna be down after we're done with the style. So I pulled it into like a little crazy bun. I'm gonna take that out really quick so that I can work with the hair. Now for the first like not for the first bun that I'm gonna be doing. I kinda want it right here, like right on the top of my head. So I'm gonna take the section that I parted before and I'm just gonna take a third of it because there's gonna be three buns. So let's see. I want about a third of the hair here. A little less than that, I think. Right there. And I'm gonna be using this for our first little top knot on the top. So I do my buns really weird. People always tell me that I do my busty buns weird. It's just kind of how I do them. So you can do yours however you want to do it. Mine, I take the little section that I have and I kind of just wrap my hand around like this, twist under, and then I just twirl and like create like a little bun thing right here. And then I kind of just let it get messy and then I pin and pull to where I feel like, you know, it'll look nice. So here I'm just gonna pin in a couple of places, make sure it's nice and tight so that it doesn't come out. Pin down those edges a little bit. And back a little bit. And then I kind of want it to be like big and fluffy and nice. And just kind of fluff it wherever I think it needs to be fluffed pull a little bit so it's a little bit messy. And then I have my first little bun. Now I've got a little bit more of my hair back here and I'm just gonna start on the second bun that's gonna go right behind the first one. So I take another section of my hair. Like so. And I'm going to again do the bun and tuck it right behind this first one and start pinning. And then I'm gonna take my last little section of hair and do the third bun, kind of on the crown of my head, tucking it right behind that second bun. fix this front piece because it's a little floppy. So I'm just gonna tuck and pin back here to where it's not quite as floppy. And that's a little bit better. And then I'm gonna let the rest of my hair down. And there you have it. Now I'm going to show y'all the final spin. And so you guys know that I love buns. And when I was a kid, I used to always put my hair up in braided buns or just plain buns and my family nicknamed me the librarian because there's like a librarian stereotype and they all have the buns and the glasses and whatever. And this would even be a good like prom do, it's a fancy updo, it's, I mean this is a nice hairstyle you could dance with this in, you could do, I mean there's like tons of ways that you could use this hairstyle. So I love it. Comment down below if you guys had any nicknames that your family called you, so mine was obviously the librarian. Also be sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking the flower right down here. And you can check out Bailey and I's prom proposal video by clicking the little box over here. And you guys maybe be able to use this hairstyle when you get asked to prom. So go check it out and we'll see you guys next week. Bye! Mwah.